Hey guys, today we are going to talk about fly control systems, also known as fly stabilizers. Fly control systems are electronic devices that constantly monitor the aircraft's orientation and motion through different sensors, including gyroscopes and accelerometers. These systems can detect any deviation from the desired fly path or current aircraft attitude and make real-time adjustments to the control surfaces such as ailerons, elevators and rudders to maintain stable flight and make the aircraft very responsive to pilot inputs. Flight stabilizers are forbidden in F3A competitions and I'm not going to discuss that now, but I understand why more and more RC pilots are using them as it significantly enhances your flight experience, especially with tiny airplanes. In my ongoing search to find an accessible yet high-performing RC aerobatic solution, I haven't stopped exploring the capabilities of the Skylark, which I introduced in my previous video. This mini F3A, and with beginner pilots in mind, seemed like the perfect candidate to test the potential benefits of using flight stabilizers, so I decided to experiment with integrating one of Dualski's flight controller, the FC-151, into the Skylark. The FC-151 is equipped with a 3-axis gyroscope and accelerometer, ensuring precise control and stability in roll, pitch and yaw. It weighs only 8 grams and has a compact size, so easy to install it in any aircraft. The system is very adaptable to different aircraft setups, whether you are using a plane with one or two ailerons, wings, V-tails or if you need flapper on mixing. In terms of installation and accessories, it comes with all you need, cables for the different connection and even double-sided tape to hold it into your aircraft. Remember that you will have to connect the flight controller between your servos and your receiver, but if you are a Futaba user, everything will be easier, as it supports SBAS and SBAS2. Programming the FC-151 is very simple, following the manual with its single set button and LED interface to adjust the different parameters. You can adjust the sensitivity and direction using the three dials for each axis. As with most of these systems, you will have to define a channel, normally channel number 5, to select the different flight modes available with one of your transmitter switches. As you can see on my previous video, I was impressed with the flight capabilities of the Skylark as it comes out of the box. But I can tell you that right after installing the FC-151, it was like flying a new airplane. The improvement is significant, increasing the stability and responsiveness, especially when flying in windy conditions. This flight controller features three flight modes, non-stabilized, aerobatic stabilization and auto-leveling. When performing F3A, the aerobatic stabilization will provide you great stability in any position during the whole maneuver, keeping the airplane very responsive to your inputs. It really does what you are asking the model to do, and the flight controller takes care of the rest. It definitely improves the stability of the lines, getting closer to the feeling you can get from one full-size F3A of today. Careful, it doesn't mean that the flight controller flies the airplane for you. You have to still steer and give all the inputs to perform any maneuver but it definitely enhances the experience and your control over the model, giving you the sensation of flying on rails. The auto level works pretty well, and after a short simulator session, my wife was able to fly for the first time an RC plane alone. So it is a great option in case you are learning how to fly too. What I also did is to adjust my fail safe to throttle 0%, as always, and the mode switch to auto level position. This way, if I lose the RC link, the airplane would go down safer. In summary, the FC-151 flight controller from DualSky enhances the aircraft stability and responsiveness. It is easy to install and set up, and with an affordable price of around 35 euros makes it a very interesting investment for pilots of all levels. Despite being forbidden in certain competitions like F3A, their benefits are clear, especially for smaller airplanes like the Skylark, and if you are starting in aerobatics I would definitely recommend it, as it is going to help you a lot if you are a beginner, and it's going to make it more enjoyable if you are already an experienced RC pilot. I confess that I am obsessed with the combo, and I am flying the Skylark almost every day before or after work whenever I have a moment. You can find more information in our website together with all the other Dualski products available. Hope it was interesting and see you guys in the next one.